Hi, I'm Robert Ring with OS Training, and we're very happy to be working with InMotion Hosting to bring you this tutorial on how to move or migrate a Drupal 8 site. Thanks to InMotion also for providing the server space used in this tutorial. When you're working with content management systems like Drupal, moving a site from one location to another can be a little complicated. So in this tutorial, I'm going to walk you through the steps of doing so. This tutorial does assume you have a basic understanding of how to install and use Drupal 8 and how to perform a basic manual backup of your Drupal 8 site. So if you don't have those skills, be sure to check out our tutorials on those things first before you go forward. For this site tutorial, we're moving a built site from our local development environment to our web host, but everything we're going over here also applies to moving your site from one web host to another. At this point, pause the video and go ahead and install Drupal 8 onto your normal development environment. My site is called All About Soap, but you can call yours whatever you want. Once you've done that, also install the Devel module. Make sure you're getting the 8.x version. As of the recording of this tutorial, there's not yet a recommended full release for 8.x. There is a development release, however, that is currently working just fine, so you can use that. But if you have a green version up here, make sure you use that version of Devel instead. Once that's done, come back and we'll continue. Okay, once you have your site installed and you've downloaded the Devel module onto your site, go ahead and go to Extend. Now we're going to simply enable the Devel module. Scroll down a bit, and you'll find it under Development. The only sub-modules we're going to use here are Devel, of course, the main one, and Devel Generate. We're not going to use the rest of these in this tutorial. So go ahead and enable those and click Install. And what the Devel module does, and specifically the Devel Generate sub-module, is it allows you to create lots of dummy content to use on a test site. We're going to more or less use the dummy content as our real content for this tutorial site, just so we don't have to go through the process of manually creating a bunch of nodes to test out our site moving skills. So once you've installed Devel and Devel Generate, go to Configuration, and then under the Development group, you should have an option now that says generate content. Go ahead and click on that. And let's create some articles. So select article. 50 nodes is a good amount. I like to set this back to one year ago. You can allow some comments per node if you want to. I'm not going to worry about that. Let's change the maximum number of words and titles to three because sometimes the words used here can get a little bit long. And everything else here should be fine. Click Generate, and you should have a message saying that your site has finished creating 50 nodes successfully. Let's go ahead and add some basic pages, just for good measure. Let's say we only want five of these. We'll do the same thing here, one year ago, I'm not going to worry about comments, three words. Make sure you have not selected delete all content in these content types. Go ahead and click Generate. And so now we have five basic pages. If we go back to our site now, your site should look roughly like this. You won't have the exact same site titles or images, but you should have a long list of gibberish with articles with titles, content, and images attached, and you can click on them to view the full node. And that's all we're gonna do. This is the site we're going to use We've basically created a site now. This is the one we're going to move to a different environment to walk through the steps of moving a site from one place to another. 